Hey, virtuality fans, welcome to Virtuality with Dodo. Please um like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe. You know what I'm saying to this video. Um, I'm um, I'm gonna be talking about like how I lost my, you know what I'm saying, my view, whatever like that. And um, it's no secret that I'm not a virgin, only because the bitch I have a job. So who gives a fuck? Um, so um, first we just talked. How about that? So what I'm gonna say, girl. First of all, okay, it was a boy that I was with. I went to our house, high school. Mm. Okay, it was a boy I was off to our high school, whatever like that, right? He was cool. He didn't go to my school. He went to another school. We can call him bitch. Second plan. We can call him bitch. Crispy. Who gives a fuck? So, no, we're going to call him light bulb. So, light bulb, I don't know why I decided because I just felt like that bulb is the tongue a little better. Light bulb. So, light bulb and me was together. You know what's going strong? You feel me? For, for a long time, like basically, like my whole high school, we and was together. And I don't even know how we met. Girl, how did we even meet? Mm, duh. We went to middle school together. See me? Give a fuck. But this is not the same person from my story time of my, um, this is not the same person from my domestic violence story time and other life. No, it's not the same person. This is the person I went to middle school with. These are the only two people I went with from middle school, though, so I don't do that. So we was together for like my whole high school, whatever. I never was really trying to do nothing with because girl, bye. Bye. Zip your pants up, bye. You know what I'm saying? Bye. I'm never really trying to do nothing with him because like, you know, I was really into it. I was really into having SEX and doing all that other nasty shit. I guess I just wasn't into it. Um, but so it was cool. We never really did nothing too nasty together ever. I never did nothing before when I was with him. Like, um, when I was with him, I didn't even give that man fellatio. Like, I didn't, I wasn't into that. Even then, I still didn't even take it that far. Like, I, I wasn't even into that kind of stuff. It was too much. Like, you, you asked for too much now. Now you asked for too much. Let me do. No thanks. Now you don't. Now you take it a little too far. Like, you know what I'm saying? You can take it down a couple notches. Because you had the 10 inch, you had the 2. You know what I'm saying? No, no thank you. So, um, we was together or whatever. And I used to, um, skip school and stuff. Sorry, mom. I'm gonna watch this and I used to skip school and we used to be together but we never do nothing nasty we, we, I was never like grown and fast like that oh girl he's oh girl let me get this let me just make it long story bitch so I never did like sexual with this man we just be chilling laughing playing acting dumb you know what I'm saying together like who cares so um just how little his was I'm just gonna so we was cool and I'm gonna okay the day that we did it mind you girl it was, must have been a week. It was a weekend. Mm -hmm. But I don't know. First of all, we supposed to do it one day at the school. We He lived in the basement of his uncle house, right down the street from his school. I just got to his house one day, right? And so, you just acted weird. You know what I'm saying? Act like a little bitch. Like, the fuck, I may be young, but I'm ready. Like, hurry up. You know what I'm saying? So, we down there talking about it. So, why his uncle comes to the top of the stairs? I'm not supposed to be in here, mind you. We always do me and him. I ain't going to lie to you. Always was doing stuff in cahoots. Like, we both knew it was wrong. You know what I'm saying? Like, he was like my friend. Like, we was really like best friends at, at the same time. Like, he was really my friend. That's why, like, I don't regret at all. I don't regret. You know, some, some people have stories about losing their virginity and they regret it. Like, I do not regret it. Like, that was really my homie for real. You know what I'm saying? So, like, um, we downstairs in the basement one day. And when I first, when me and him first went down there, his brother was down there with his older brother. And they cool though, they get the smoke. I'm like, what are you doing? Like, this is when I was not into no smoking, drinking. I never hit a J before. This is ninth grade. I was very young. This is the beginning because I did I did smoke. Okay, this is not fucking Anyway. So he but this is when I wasn't smoking. He was smoking before me. You feel me? So I was like, ill, you know what I'm saying? Ill, fuck out of here. Fuck out of here, you're high. You know what I'm saying? So, um, what happened with that? I'm trying, I'm just going off the dome like I'm living in a motherfucking room. You feel me? So he talking about some, uh, I was ready to do it or whatever. I was probably kissing whatever like that. And so when it's time to do it, why the, wasn't he getting up? It just wasn't working. That was time from God. I should have listened. It just wasn't working though. Like it just really literally just was not working. And I'm just like, bro, what do you got going on? I'm just confused. Just hold on real quick. Ball weird ass. Fuck, bop, build the build body ass. Like, the fuck? We was like, hi, you. The fuck? Talking about some hold on real quick. His ugly ass built in the motherfucking bathroom with one strand of fucking hair. Looking like cocoa melon and shit. 
and go to the bathroom. I guess try and get it up and it just would not work. Bro, I said, oh, <laughs> fuck wrong with him. You know what I'm saying? Fuck, we got a condition. So, erectile dick dysfunction. Ain't that what's called? Anyway, so, um, we didn't do it that day though. It just wouldn't work. It's literally, it wouldn't work. Oh, so, So literally, so literally wouldn't work, right? So it wasn't no biggie though. You know what I'm saying? It's not even that serious. We're just chilling. So let's probably fast forward like a year or two. Girl, it must have been too early to do it, huh? That's what it was. Anyway, maybe not a year. Was that a year? Yeah, it must have been a little minute. Close my opportunity in the summertime. I think I lost my virginity right before I was about to go to college or something. Had it been. I had it been. Yeah. So, the day that it did happen, we was at his great aunt house. His great aunt was had to be about 98, 100, 108, 2052. Who the fuck knows? You was old as hell. Sorry, woman, if you, if you, you know what I'm saying, come across, you was old. You was old. Come on now, you know you was old as fuck. You mad at me, bitch. Only way not to get old is to die. So look. And so she was, she was, um, we weren't supposed to be in it. His aunt was so strict. You know, usually people are not strict. Bitch. Fuck, talking all that shit. Usually people are not strict with males like that. I'm like, God damn, like, she got, yeah, she put her motherfucking foot down, foot down. I'm like, God damn. I had her foot away his motherfucking neck. He couldn't do nothing. Like, she, he did whatever the fuck he wanted, but he couldn't have nobody. He couldn't have no females and he couldn't do nothing, bruh. So one day she out with her little church convention, bitch. You know, when motherfuckers go to church convention, they ain't worried about what the fuck going on. They don't worry about Jesus and God. God and Jesus and Mary and the 12 disciples. So she go to the little church, the little jump, though, and I go over there. I, I don't think I spent the night. I don't know. I, I, No, I don't think so this time. Nope. Mm -mm. So look, so we in there, whatever. We doing our thing. We cooling. It wasn't like planned or nothing like that. This man, this is so tight. He was sleeping on the, he's managing his aunt, a great house because it was only one bedroom. So he was slept on a couch, but it was like a pullout couch type of thing. So it was like a little bed. You know what I'm saying? It was all right. You know what I'm saying? But he was a nice boyfriend though. Like he was. He was very respectful. He wasn't a bad. I can't even, I can't even say nothing. Bad about him. That's why I said, like, my experience of losing my virginity is like, I picked a good person. And that's what I, if somebody, if little girls or little boys, whatever, old they and bears or whoever, is watching this and they like want like advice on should I do it, I feel like you do it with somebody who you know who you really love, who really love you. Not somebody who playing with you. Not somebody who not texting you back. Not somebody who not calling you. Not somebody who not your boyfriend. Like, I feel like if you first lose your virginity, it should be like your boyfriend. He cares about you. You know he care about you. Like to the point where other people like, call he really, to the point, not, you know how niggas be lying. Niggas be lying like shit. But I said to the point where people are like, oh, y'all are so cute. Like they, you feel what I'm saying? It should be one of them kind of relationships. Everybody used to be like, y'all are so cute. Like people used to be like, fuck with us. You know what I'm saying? And like, you know, like it should be like one of them situations where y'all are together. Me and him was together for years before I did it with him. You know? So I picked a really good person. I did. I can't even, I can't even shit on them like that. You know what I'm saying? Other than me beating shit out of his side chick. Okay. What the fuck in the world? Still was a good person though. This is just some childish shit that happened, bro. You feel me? I, I wouldn't have it no other way. Bro. You feel me? So anyway, so we 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 at his own house. We at, um, we call her church. Nah, I'm going to hell if I said some shit like that. Or a candle. Candle. Um, we call her Rain Jacket. Mm, that's some good stuff. Okay, we ain't giving no damn name. So, she's not there, so we lit. We eating this shit. I think we had got some Subway. No, we must have went to Safeway because he had food stamps. We can have what's the hell, bro. He had food stamps right there. I think he bought some stuff. Because I know I'm, I'm very picky. He had bought some stuff so we could eat and shit like this. We can cook. He was cool. I was like, I said, that's like my best. That's literally my best friend. Like, you feel me? And so, we doing our thing, and we chilling. And I don't know how one thing escalated to another, but I remember we um, was doing it, and oh my God. And so, 
we kiss and whatever like that. Like I said, I was ready to do it. Like I wanted to do it for some reason. You feel me? Like it had been, I had never done it, obviously. I just once I was curious at this point. So we do it. This man puts it in. He, you know he's making sure I'm okay and all the other shit. You feel me? I'm saying? It's crazy. I'm not going to say what he said. This shit's cringy as hell. You feel me? It's just cringy. You feel me? So I think it did probably hurt us a little bit. But it wasn't nothing too bad. Like when I was growing up, one of my siblings told me losing your virginity is like having a baby. So that made me never want to have sex. I said, well, I'm waiting. If it's that much, I've been seeing them bitches screaming and doing all that other shit on Discovery Channel, delivering them goddamn big head babies. I'm not, I'm not fucking with that shit. So that's really what made me never want to lose my shit to it. Because her um, bald head E.T., long finger looking motherfucker, told me that um, it feels like you give birth when you lose your virginity. So I said, never again. You know what I'm saying? So, um... I can never again, bitch. I mean, never doing it. I'm never doing it. I never did it before. I didn't lose it twice. Anyway, so, bitch. He kissing me. I, I think I might, might have made like an owl noise. No, bro. This is disgusting. I'm young as hell. I was like, yeah. I was young. It's fine. And so, um, he's like, kiss me. I'm like, mm. bitch. And so I did that or whatever. So he, he thought that was going to appease the pain. He puts it in. Strokes like twice. He came. He wore a condom though. What the fuck, bro? Like, what are you doing? So that was a whole bunch of nothing. Like, my virginity literally lasted for like 20 seconds, bro. And after that, it was fucking like rabbits. You know what I'm saying? We would have sex. You know what I'm saying? I wonder if I was in school. I don't know. All I know is, really, the moral of the story is, I feel like you should do it with somebody if you haven't lost your virginity yet. You feel me? You should do it with somebody who you feel like really care about you. Like, I feel like that should inform. Like, I ain't just lose to anybody. Like, he wasn't no random. Like, he wasn't somebody who didn't care about me. Like, if y'all wonder what position was in, it was in the missionary position. He was obviously on top of me. And I was hitting that nigga from the back. It's like, I'm gonna send this to him too, bro. I'm gonna send this video too. I was sitting that thing from the back, nigga. I'm like, nigga, your ass was tooted in the motherfucking head. It's like I'm playing. Nigga, it's like I'm playing. It's like, um, but like I had a very nice experience, you feel me? Even though it lasted for a millisecond and a half. I was like, really? I saw you done. He said, yeah. Yeah. All fucking defeated, nigga. Feel like a deflated balloon, nigga. I pop you up, motherfucker, nigga. Second plan. I'm mad. I am. I'm mad. You good? I need to invest y'all in some of these. If you don't got these to add price, then you probably gonna take a shot with just the goddamn quarantine star. If you ain't got these, then you're out. But first of all, this story was all over the place, and I feel like I could have went into way more detail, but I didn't. I just don't want it to be that long. Like I probably do a part two or whatever like that. Get my ass. But um. I'm going to try to watch the, my other story time because they funny and they would go into way more detail. But this one was very short, just like, just like his, he's a man, man. You feel me? It was very short, just like my experience. Short as fuck, short and sweet. Girl, no. Why was after what she talking about something? I don't even watch the movies. This ain't about the scenes in the movie or something. You want to go, go to Subway? Bitch, do I look like a Subway kind of nigga to you? I said, no. Fuck, let's take me home. Subway, nigga. We on the subway. The fuck? Go to subway, nigga. We want, nigga, the next car, nigga. What are you talking about? I'm trying to be cool and shit. No, nigga. But he was like trying to take me to the subway or some shit like that. I was like, bitch, the fuck? No, nigga. We on the train, bitch. We on the subway, bitch. Fuck. Um. Come on, I'm on some ribs. Mmm. Ribs. Mmm. Psycho. But yeah, that's my story, whatever, like that. Um, it really is not that much detail, only because he couldn't give it up the first time, waiting like probably a year or something. But I waited a long time. My time would be off. It was a long time after that. Like, we used to skip school together and we didn't do shit, but like, I was never like a fast girl. Ain't nothing wrong with fast girl shit. Get it how you motherfucking live it. You know? It's like, I'm fine. At least I'm getting retarded. I'm getting nice. Y'all heard that? Retarded is a bad word to say, actually. It's like pretty bad. Anyway, so, 
that's my story. If you want to hear some more story time, look on my little thing because I got me some more story time. Um, I got a story time about my domestic violence relationship. I got a story time up there that should be up there um, about how I was not molested or my whole childhood. Um, I got a lot of different story times. My, again, my name is Rachel Alexander. Please like, please comment, please subscribe so you can get notified of whenever I pull up. Oh, y'all. Second plan. So whenever I pull up, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying because I'm trying. Okay. But all right, thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for watching my face. And I just wanted to say anything. So what I'm going to do? I'm going to go. What the fuck is that? Mm-hmm. All right. Bye.